Social entrepreneurship is a form of art because it comes from the same inner place as artistic creations. It is called the heart. It has the power to move you to emotional spaces, to turn pain into passion, hope and light, filling your soul with invaluable peace. Just like music did to me throughout my journey, my tireless quest for an equal voice. I grew up in a multicultural family. People like us, my close community fellows, were considered to be different, and a right to belong was often questioned. So I went through life with this difference inside of me, carrying the weight of this heavy label. I learned to shape my voice in a beautiful and loud way through opera, finding in music a way to be heard and to channel these tribal emotions. The world became my community, and traveling across continents, I embraced its variety of colors, languages, and cultures. My professional life was rich of international experiences, but I found myself in an environment shaped by power games, ruled by exclusion and domination, played in dark man-made theaters. While my eyes witness the ravages of global conflicts, I wonder, is this what power is meant for? At that time, I felt that I was gradually losing my voice. There were also attempts to silence it. And remembered an Italian popular saying, Canta che ti passa. Sing and it will all pass. So I came back to music. I forgot what music did for me. I started writing my own scores and lyrics, building a world where we could all sing, an evolution towards a culture of inclusion. It was like a call, a sense of mission and a vision. My songs were aimed at painting the beauty of justice with a broader spectrum of colors, a harmonious symphony exploiting instead the treasures of our shared humanity. I now measure my power by the magic of our united voices each time they serve to bridge the divides and to inspire others. Sometimes I find myself rewatching these collaborative creations and I know it was all worth it.